Hey guys, in this video I'm going to do a full review of the uh, Resurrection Remix ROM, uh, which is the version 5.4.4 um, that comes with the uh, Android 5.1.1 uh, build uh, based on CM12.1. So this is actually the first time ever that I've tried out any CM12.1 ROM on my, ne on my Note 2 here. So um, I'm going to just show you here into the settings um, about phone. And you can see this is the resurrection version. Uh, this is 5.4.3. Uh, there is also another uh, version that is basically um, uh, being released uh, today, uh, which is 5.4.4. Uh, but the which also comes with the 5.1.1 lollipop version. But anyways, you can see that. This is 5.1.1, and one of the things that I noticed with this 5.1.1 uh, version is that it has become really fast, really responsive, and the speed has become really fast, you know, as compared to the previous uh, CM12 builds. And with the 5.1.1 with the CM12.1, there will be no uh, beta bugs or anything like that. This is very close to uh, the final build, you know, they are not going to make a stable CM12, they are now planning to make more stable. Um, you know, CM12.1 um, builds, uh, so CM12 will be kind of like sk skip, but yeah, CM12.1 will be the main uh, base of all the custom ROMs, so you're going to see a lot of great custom ROMs coming up, uh, I'll be making some more videos also, uh, so be sure to stay tuned, so yeah, if you go here into settings, you can see that we have some basic settings on the top, um, there is a little bit change here, uh, so I've been using some custom colors there, messing with some custom colors, which, uh, which we do have the option to change. Um, so I don't, I don't have any good combination here, you can see blue and white, uh, but I can still show you that it has those uh, quick um, 5.1.1 um, option, options here, like you can see the, the arrow here with the Bluetooth, you can see quickly change that, and then also we have the Wi-Fi Bluetooth, uh, Wi-Fi, uh, quick areas, uh, quick access, so that that is really nice. And then also, um, if I move here, uh, you can see we have the configuration. So it comes with the all new theme engine. Uh, really nice. You can download a lot of themes. Uh, so this is basically a theme that is already uh, you know uh, you get it when you install the ROM. So I'm gonna just apply this theme here. Um, all the styles and everything, boot animation, lock screen, wallpaper, and everything. Let's see. So this is how you apply the theme, and this is the theme that you will get when you install the ROM. Um, let's see how this theme is going to change the phone's overall look and everything. Okay. So you can see that now we have this uh, wallpaper on the background, looks really awesome. And uh, and you can see the icons are also changed, uh, the, the, the buttons here on the bottom, the touch keys are also changed. And then also, um, you can see that the settings are also changed, so really nice theme here. Let me just show you the name again, that if the theme is not uh, built in, then you can download it, but it, it is built in basically, so this is second pitch black dark red theme. Um, really nice. So, um, let's go again into settings here. So, uh, we have this configuration part here, where you can set up themes and everything. Then we have the display options. A lot of stuff there wake up on plug and double tap to sleep which works really fine if you double tap on the on the bat, on the status bar here is you know the device will easily go into sleep that is really nice uh, the sound and notification you can just turn off some uh, some unwanted sounds to increase the battery uh, a little bit more like this here you can just turn off all these sounds even the screenshot sound uh, so this is really good to increase the battery life. And then also we have the storage option. This is the uh, storage that we get. So this is 16 gigabyte uh, Galaxy Note 2 here, and um, you know you can see that we have almost like 10.46 GB available internal, and then you can also mount an XD, uh, external SD card if you want to. That is really nice. Um, you know, really good flexible phone, Galaxy Note 2. Um, you know, basically we have heard some news about its official update uh, which is not going to come um, that is a, a not good a good news for node 2 users uh, but but still we're going to wait what will happen so here we have the system profile um, then also some normal Android options developer options you can mess with some stuff here 
and one more thing that I want to show you is that we do have the performance option here you can um, you know before playing any game you can set the profile to performance or um, you know if you are if you're going to conserve the battery you can just have it on the power save and you can see that the power saving mode is now on uh, or if you just want the mixture of both of these stuff you can just have it on the balance option so uh, this is how the, uh, the the multitask area looks like just click on this key and then close everything um, this is how the lock screen looks like I mean uh, basically I've seen some lag in terms of the lock screen like you know when I press the the power key it, it takes like um, you know maybe like uh, 3 to 4 seconds to show the screen uh, previously uh, but now this is a little bit more quicker um, so you can just swipe off to unlock the device and then you can also uh, quickly go into the dialer or camera um, so this is by far the best Android 5.1.1 lollipop ROM that you can have on your Galaxy Note 2. Really, really stable stuff here. Um, so the basic stuff here, the camera and everything works really fine. You can see I'm, I have opened up the front camera. I'm going to just switch to the back here. So you can see that uh, you can just focus everything here. Uh, I can just focus my hand here. And then also you can just capture photos. Quickly go into gallery. You can also um, start editing your photo. Uh, really nice. Then also, this button also works. You can also use these buttons on the bottom. But this, but these button looks really awesome. This, these touch uh, but keys on the uh, built into display here. This, this looks really easy as compared to these these three buttons here. Uh, so you don't need to just press this home key. And then also, uh, this is how the dialer looks like. Uh, yeah, and this is a normal Cyanogen uh, mod dialer, but uh, but basically the team has make and has made it a little bit more uh, cooler. Uh, then also uh, we do have the uh, file manager, which is really nice. Uh, you can see that I do have only one internal storage, no memory card installed. Uh, the, the normal browser, the audio FX, yeah, this is a good thing about the CM12.1, really nice. Um, if you listen to music, you will you definitely going to enjoy this um, this feature there, calculator, and then gallery, uh, the normal signage and gallery. So yeah, the really nice stuff here. I'm going to recommend this ROM to anyone out there who, who wants uh, to install the Android 5.1.1 Lollipop on uh, their Galaxy Note 2. I'll be making a video of how to install the 5.1.1 ROM on your Galaxy Note 2, no matter what ROM that you're going to install it. I'm going to make a tutorial for that. And make sure you subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. It really do helps me out a lot. And I'll see you in my next one. Peace out.